Hi, everyone. May 13, 2019. You know, I don't understand what it is about the Oroville Dam posting on the Oroville Dam that elicits so many people leaving comments that are, uh, well, angry, to say the least, uh, obscene comments about how I don't know what I'm talking about. Oh my God, um, there's an awful lot of people saying the exact same thing that I'm saying. So, yeah, I don't know what's going on there, but it is now at, uh, Lake Oroville is now at 889.02 feet. Okay, you are 12 feet away from that, uh, overflow of the emergency spillway well that that seems to be okay except for what is forecasted okay I will link below to another video another channel that is posting on the Orville Dam overflow warning just posted today and um, it does seem to me that this is a man who lives in the area and who is paying close attention. I will link below to everything so you guys in this area uh, you need to be paying very very close attention. Now someone said that the live cam was not working at the Orville Dam so I came over here to the live cam and it is on spillway three cams um, and it still looks like well someone told me that this was just um, water that is spilling out of the gates the leaks in the gate they still have not um, released any water so but the, well that's why you keep seeing the lake inching up well, I posted this, um, how long ago? When did I post it? May 10, three days ago. And I included videos, this video. And in this video, they are talking about a posting of the National Weather Service in Sacramento stating that, well, California, you're going to be getting a very active weather pattern with systems moving through the region starting next week. Uh, the Climate Prediction Center keeps the area in above normal chances for precipitation. And I did note in the description box that I had just checked the weather forecast for Northern California and it contradicted the National Weather Service forecast. I did get a comment from someone below who said they checked the weather for Northern California and no rain was coming. Well, suddenly that has changed quite a bit, quite a bit. Um, let's see, tonight, no rain. Tuesday, no rain. Wednesday, 90% chance, 90% chance Thursday, 40% uh, Friday, 80% Saturday, 80% Sunday, 40% Monday, Sunday, Tuesday, live cam, um, and it goes on. I mean, they're predicting rain from Wednesday all the way through to uh, one week of rain, one week of rain, and then Friday showers again, Thursday mostly sunny. That's a lot of rain. Well, I also want to point out that they're even calling for more snow in the Sahara 
impressive Bay Area rainfall and snow, more snow. Has the snow begun to melt? I don't know. But more snow, more rain, that's very concerning for the Oroville dams. San Francisco could endure months worth, a month's worth of rain in a single day. Wow. All right, well, uh, series of storms could threaten bay, air, bay to breakers. I don't know where the breakers are. Um, I know that San Francisco is about, I don't know, 160 miles away from Oroville Dam. Uh, you could possibly get rain in San Francisco and not, you know, up uh, more north in California. But that's why I checked the Oroville weather. So I will link below to everything, but... Uh, yeah, still very concerning. I hope everybody has, you know, a plan for evacuation, should you need to. Um, and I hope you don't need to. Stay safe, everybody.